Good morning, good evening, and good afternoon, ladies and gents, and welcome back to AS2 and the Tannenberg line in 1944. The Germans have set up some defences over some open wasteland ground, and although the, uh, the weather isn't exactly on our side, I think our, our defences are pretty damn strong, and uh, I'm hopeful that we'll be able to fend off whatever attack comes from the Russian yeah, lines. Somewhere over there. <laughs> so without further ado, let's jump straight into the battle. So as we wait for the Russians to uh, approach our lines, I'll take you through our defences very, very quickly. Uh, we have around about a uh, platoon and a half's worth of infantry defending our front trench lines. We've got a couple of machine guns in semi-bunkered and bunkered positions. And we have our Flak 88 gun ready to pound any T-34s that make their way towards us. And then in reserves, we have two uh, mortars. We're gonna provide some nice IDF fire support and uh, a squad of infantry. No, the no man's land is, uh, well, pretty disastrous to say the least. Um, there's very little cover anywhere we have a lot of anti-tank traps a lot of anti-infantry traps we don't have any mines out there but i think the uh, the barbed wire and the anti-tank trap will do them justice anyway now so far so good we don't have any enemies but to be honest with you it's kind of there is a tree line over there but in this fog and rain and everything it's quite hard to see i know there's a couple down vehicles in places. I literally can't see the enemy. <laughs> oh, this is going to be fun. I can hear them. But I can't. <gasps> They're trying to crawl up on us, the sneaky bastards. There they go. There we go. There we go. can't actually see them. Are they still trying to push the lines? Because I can't, I can't actually see them. Did we lose anyone? Oh yeah, we lost quite a few guys. Damn it! How many did we wipe out in that? Oh wow! 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 Okay, I like. <laughs> I didn't even see half these guys. Holy crap, and there's still a few of them up. Well, not for long, to be honest with you, but... I didn't even see these guys. Holy moly. At least they're only sending infantry so far. That's one bonus, I guess. Well, I can only imagine, because it's the Russians, that they're going to send attack after attack after attack until they defeat our lines. Or until they run out of men. Which usually doesn't happen very fast. I mean, we're putting up a hell of a defense. But I just. <laughs> I can't tell when one wave, like, ends and the other, like, another wave begins.
Well, I have to admit, that's not a sound I particularly wanted to hear. Because that means tanks. That, without a doubt, means tanks. But I can't see them. Oh, I see infantry. So that last attack inflicted a hell of a lot of casualties. Like, a hell of a lot. We lost so, so many men in that. It was ridiculous. Luckily, though, our, uh, um, our fire support is still well and truly up and running and pounding away at their enemy positions. I think currently, if it wasn't for these mortars, we would have been done a long, long time ago. I'm just dreading the moment that they bring in tanks. Wait, is that an engine? I think that must be an engine. That must be an engine. Right, I'm taking control of this now. Load up, load up, load up, load up, load up. Where is he? Where's the tank? Come on, chappies, get back up. Get up, get up, get up, get up, get up. Repair it. We need it up and running. Ladies and gentlemen, in the nick of time, some friendly armor has shown up to assist us. And it is perfect timing. We need to take out these T-34s ASAP. That's one down. And that is two down. Make sure they can't use it again. Thing. If we get this to sit somewhere back in the woods where it can't be seen, then uh, this could do very nicely indeed. Well, ladies and gents, we have little to no lines left at all, but our MGs are still up and in striking distance. We have a tank, we have our uh, um, static AT weaponry. I think we might just be able to survive this. We've lost, well, practically the entirety of our front lines and uh, the enemy casualties have been a slight bit heavier than mine oh for goodness sake really it's any another attack come on now That was another vehicle. Are they sending more at us? Oh uh, shit, yeah, more T-34s coming in to support their infantry. Well, Panzer IV, it's all up to you now. It is all up to you, bud. Oh god, we got a fourth one coming in. Uh, how many we've blown up so far? Yeah, there's number one, and then two and three. Well, Panzer, good luck. Oh, so much for that. Our Panzer's been knocked out. Well, chappies, it's down to you now. Good luck. We have Russian infantry slowly pushing through the field. Oh, have they sent reinforcements? 
Yep, they've sent reinforcements. Okay, I think this is it for our lines. Problem is, I'm not sure. Oh, chappies, where are you? What, what are you trying to do? That was never going to work out, was it? That, oh, you came from the bunker in there. Oh, okay. Hopefully my mortars can uh, thin out this stuff that's coming through. Otherwise, we are truly screwed. I think as soon as they get to the brow of this hill, there's going to be another firefight and another shootout. And I think we are going to lose. Yeah, here we go. Come on, Jed, you've got this. Pick them off as they come in. The tanks can't get up there because they can't get over the trenches. The mortar's going to keep firing for as long as they can. You've got this. Come on now. Oh, bugger. Sorry, traps. Game over. Game over, boys. The rest of the mortars are still up and running, but I don't think that's going to happen for long. Keep going at them for as long as you can, boys. Kill as many as you can, because this tank's about to get you. Well, chaps. I'm afraid that is game over for the German forces. We put up one hell of a fight and uh, our casualties compared to the other side are, well, minuscule. So I guess you can kind of look at that as a strategic victory in numbers, but uh, overall it's a major, major defeat. Although we smashed out a ton of uh, Russian infantry and a number of Russian vehicles and tanks as well. The inevitable came round and bit us in the arse. But as always, ladies and gents, thank you very much for watching. Thank you very much for the support. And I'll see you on the battlefield.